Hi there. My name's Jeremy. What's my form of activism? I'm a video editor. I'm a volunteer for animal equality. I help care for two awesome vegan dogs. What do you think that is? I'm a printing company. I'm a vegan athlete. I'm a web developer. I'm an artiste. I did a 22 day water only fast. I'm a competitive eater. Three, two, one, go. It's about to begin. And go. Oh, come on, Jeremy. Go be good. Woo! It's the Carolina Reaper. I'll tell you what, you lot are weird. Three, two, one. Since I've never done anything like this before, I thought it'd be a good idea to practice. <coughs> that one got me a little bit. I help support new vegans by being a mentor for Challenge 22. I'm gonna give up alcohol for a month to inspire others to try Veganuary. I volunteer at an animal sanctuary. Sometimes I have to deal with a bit of crap. Other times I get to cuddle with amazing animals. How you doing, Doc? Hey, Alma. Some of our residents can be a bit pushy. <laughs> These guys always quack me up. This resident's a bit peckish. Some days are quite shocking. Some of our residents get breakfast in bed. <laughs> it's all worth it when you get to spend time with amazing non-human animals like these. I'm a student of psychology, and I use the techniques I've learned to inspire the most change when engaging members of the public, and I love breaking down my street interviews from a behavioral psychology perspective on my YouTube channel. I'm a street interviewer. And then they wind up here. The good thing is we can do something about this. We can choose to stop supporting this. Yeah. Veganism, you save between two to 400 animals lives per year. Would you like to sign up to a three-week vegan challenge? A vegan challenge? Yeah. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah. Give, give it a go. Awesome. Why not? Why not? Why not? So, right, give all right, give me a go. All right. Oh, that's awesome. Thank that feels you. good. That feels good. Yeah. All right. I'm a presenter. I didn't eat anything for 22 days. That's one day longer than Gandhi's <laughs> longest fast. I withdrew. That all changed about uh, early, earlier this year when I started to proactively engage others on a topic. <laughs> it doesn't really matter what questions we ask. The goal is to break down that disconnect between animals and what we eat. Now this is me about four years ago before I went vegan. This isn't a bad guy. There's seeds of compassion within him. I like to go into every interaction like I'm talking to this guy because I know if I water those positive seeds, they'll naturally blossom into veganism. <laughs> I'm a co-organizer for the Brighton chapter of Anonymous for the Voiceless. All right, guys, awesome. Let's get out there and inspire change. <laughs> cool. I think that's around 100. Awesome dog, guys. I'm a co-founder of Vegan Interactions, and I want to help others understand the psychology of change and the communication skills that helped me become an effective voice for the animals. If the vegan community is able to be heard and understood, together we can create a vegan world. What's my form of activism? What isn't? Truth is like a lion. Set it free and it can defend itself. A vegan world is coming. Every single person in this room here today has the capability to inspire change. Change happens because one person stands up, then two people stand up, then ten people stand up, then a hundred people stand up. Before you know it, thousands of people are standing up. I want to stand up for the animals. Will you join me?